fill the tape for this heavyweight fight. Three years apart, with big differences in height and reach. Here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. When the action begins, our referee in charge of the Octagon, Herb Dean. is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. It's time! Five rounds in the UFC heavyweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a mixed martial artist making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds, fighting out of Los Angeles, California, Bruce the Dragon Lee! And now with his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a kickboxer making his professional debut here tonight. He stands six feet six inches tall, weighing in at 265 pounds. Fighting out of Hong Kong, Juggernaut. You've been given your instruction in the dressing room. Protect yourself at all times. Follow my instructions. We will have a clean fight. Touch gloves. This, this is a fight that we have been looking forward to for a long time and is about to take place right now. I'm very excited. Ready to fight? Ready. Here we go. He lands a knee here. Huge uppercut misses. And mixing it up beautifully. Oh! Just misses with the jab there. Nice. Pretty good head movement to slip that right hand. Lee gets caught with that punch. Oh, nicely done with the head kick. Well, he ate a pretty big head kick there, Joe, and he's got to be careful moving forward, moving into striking range, leaving that head wide open. I know his corner looks frustrated. Let's see if this team can make the requisite adjustments. Try some serious power in that kick, but misses. Oh, beautiful, beautiful kick to the butt. Nice jab. Starting to see some of the damage cut underneath that right eye. Clean punch. Oh, landed it. Unable to connect with the right hand there. Just over three minutes to go, round one. Quick jab. Under three minutes remain in round one. Head kick. Lands to the body. Wow. Lee gets caught with that punch. He'd be wise to get those hands up, Joe. Oh, so another head kick lands now, at least partially. So several of those have found the target in this round. And now you can see the damage really starting to take effect on his opponent. Going to the body there with the right kick. Just over two minutes now to go.
range with that one. Well, he got cracked to the head there, Joe. He's gonna have to change things up here with his footwork, with his tempo. He continues to be vulnerable to that strike coming back. Gotta get his head off the center line. Lead left by Lee. With 90 seconds to go in round one. Let's work, guys. Huge block there. Going to the body now with that hook shot. Nicely done by Lee. Lands an outside leg kick of his own. He got tagged there. Going to the side kick. Watch the shot here, Joe. Tagged him. Final minute. Just misses there. Oh, no! Huge right hand! He's in big trouble. Just out of range with that right hook. Lee's kick is blocked. Kick to the body is there. All right, 20 seconds to go in the round. And here he is back in familiar territory in the clinch. He's got the double. And now he's got that tie clinch. We'll see what he can do with it. Oh, huge elbow. You see the cut on his lip, ladies and gentlemen, is only getting worse. Likely gonna need to get stitched up after the fact, and blood in and around the mouth area could upset his breathing pattern. Not a good reality for him here tonight. Here's a perfect head kick. Here's a powerful punch that devastates. There's a powerful kick to the body. Thank you very much, Ariane Celeste. You ready to fight? Ready. Go. All right, round two. That last round was absolutely insane. Both guys hurt on multiple occasions. If they continue it this way in this round, someone's going to get knocked out. All right, inside the numbers now, in terms of the head kicks landed, really his primary weapon thus far. And you gotta wonder at this point of the fight, how many more flush shots to the dome can his opponent actually take before he ends up twitching on the canvas? Absolutely. Oh, he nailed him with that right hand. Oh, he missed that kick. How about that chin? He lands the head kick. Oh, that was a big left hand he connected with. Really threw everything into that uppercut, but fell short. Oh, huge shot there. Well, he's playing with fire here, Joe. He continues to be vulnerable to that jab by almost leaning into it right into his opponent's range. Got to find a way to move those feet and ultimately get that head off of the center line. Oh, tagged him. Body kick now by Lee. Wham! The right and the left behind it. He's got a beautiful leg kick. Just missed with the straight left hand. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. That one hurt. Oh! Really threw a lot of power into that uppercut, but missed.
effective jab there by Lee. Just missed with the left there. Well, he's really picked up the pace here in round two. Much more aggressive now here and starting to find himself in the pocket. Oh, effective use of the jab by Lee. Really missed with that right hand. Able to land to the body there with the left kick. Just over two minutes now to go in round two. Nice. Oh, he lands another strike to the body here. He's really starting to connect Joe on a lot of these strikes to the midsection. Looking to establish the jab here. Nicely done by Lee. He landed that inside leg kick. That strike will count. Wow, what a back and forth exchange. Good kick to the body. Oh, beautiful lead right hand. Nice punch by Lee. the strike. Nice inside leg kick. Oh, that cut is a real factor now, Joe. He is bleeding out. I wouldn't be surprised if they stop this fight. Unable to connect there. Oh, continuing to work the body to great effect. Effective strike there by Lee. Beautiful right hook. 30 seconds now to go in the round. Oh, and he continues to pour it on. We mentioned earlier the aggression with his striking. I'm careful to not gas out here, but at least you have to admire the approach. Pretty good knee to the body by Lee. Nice inside leg kick. Very nice. Looking to avoid that left hand. And the horn sounds on round two. All right, so that's the end of the round, and I'm not sure how he's dealing with the blood at this point in time. That lip has gotten really, really bad. There's blood in the mouth, and you got to think, Joe, this is upsetting his breathing pattern a little bit. And I would think if it gets any worse, the doctor's going to have to get in there and stop the fight. And here's another clean shot that lands. And another perfectly placed strike. Very impressive striking going on in that round. Brittany Palmer here doing her thing as usual. You ready to fight? Ready. Third round underway. All right, next round is underway, and I'm excited to see it, Joe Rogan. Pretty good round for both guys the last time out. Now we'll see if one fighter or another can really take control of this fight. Both fighters have been aggressive, but also defensive. We'll see how they approach this next round and try to really put this fight in their favor. Well, he has landed some good shots tonight, Joe, but as yet, he has been unable to string together any solid combinations, and that has served to keep his opponent in this fight. So let's see if he can change up the tempo a little bit with his strikes and try to put together a combination that is more damaging to his opponent. Well, he hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. He continues to connect on a high volume of strikes here. Big power shot there. we show you the total strikes? Oh! He's getting busted up. Just out of range with that right hand. Oh, blocks that kick to the body, Joe. 
Well, you gotta start to change things up here defensively. Again, he gets clipped to the head, and again, he's vulnerable by leaning right into his opponent's range. Excellent movement on the ground here, always trying to better his position. He's got a half guard here. Oh, going for a choke here, Joe. This could be dangerous. He got out of that choke. Both fighters back to their feet now. These shoulder strikes really keep his opponent off guard, keep him thinking. For position here. Oh, he pummels under. Now he's got the underhook. And separate. Huge uppercut misses. Well, not sure if he's lighter on his feet or what it is, but these last couple of rounds, he's been far more aggressive, a lot more pressure. Oh, he's really starting to light him up now. And he continues to work the body here. Him there, beautiful shot to the body. Caught him with a punch. And speed, man. Oh, this is crazy! Oh my goodness! He's hurt to the body. You can tell that shot hurt him bad. Oh, that's a big block, Joe. Oh, very nice. Under two minutes to go in round three. Lee's lower jaw does not look good. I don't think it's broken, but starting to show some obvious signs of swell. Oh! Misses with that punch. Everything into that kick, but fell short. Oh, big left. Well, he absorbs a kick to the head here, left it wide open. He's got to not move into that power shot. Let's see if he can adjust. That one hurt. Seconds now to go in the round. Oh, excellent exchange there. The takedown is not there. Man, looks like he's trying to set records here, landing all of these strikes. He is aggressive to a fault and really has been all night long as he continues to pour it on. Got to be careful here, though, not to gas out. Well, that left hand has been there at times, not on that. And we're headed to the championship rounds. All right, so that's the end of the round. He got some things done offensively, but defense still an issue. And as such, the cut on his lip is only getting worse. Here's a nasty head kick that lands. And here's one more perfectly placed head kick. Lots of action in that round. That was really hurt him there. I need more. Brittany Palmer is in the building doing work as usual. Ready to fight. Ready. All right, here's round four. Fight scheduled for five five-minute rounds. <laughs> He's definitely going to want to start this round off fast and try to pick up where he left off. His opponent was in big trouble at the end of that round. Oh, 
Well, not only has he stayed aggressive as he was in the previous round, landing a high volume of strikes, but he's also been efficient, not just with his strikes, but also with his body movement. Complete performance out of this fighter here tonight. How about that chin? Oh, Joe, that cut is getting worse. Rated R, looking nasty now. Yep, not a ton behind it, but it landed. Beautiful kick to the body there, and he just left himself wide open for that strike. Very vulnerable by leaning in, keeping the guard high to allow for an opening down low. Trying to go to the body here, unable to find the target. Oh, how good is that jab by Lee? for the fences with that hook, but misses. Clean, hard shot to the head with that hook. Joey missed with that straight right attempt. Lee gets caught with that punch. Gotta shore up the defense here. Trying to find a home for that right hand. Slips. All right, less than three minutes to go here in round four. Tagged him. with that straight left hand, Joe. Just over two minutes to go. Really threw everything into that uppercut, but fell short. Would you look at the size of that bruise on his torso? Nasty. That knee might have landed there. And now he's got that tie clinch, Joe. Good opportunity to do significant damage here. Over underhooks here. Oh, he worked hard for it. He's now got double underhooks in the clinch. And drops under. He's got the leg. And this might just be a matter of time. Oh, and this there fight's it is. over. This fight's over. He set it up. It was beautiful technique, and he was forced to tap. Beautiful submission. Yeah, Joe, we know you can appreciate that. High-level jujitsu there executes the submission there, and a nice job, too, in transition to make sure that he was patient enough to set it up effectively, and the end of the fight came shortly thereafter. High-level stuff. And here's the end. And here it is again, absolutely perfectly executed. And finally, one more time, no choice but to tap. So a seminal moment for him here tonight, Joe Rogan, as he gets the win by way of submission. Certainly one of the bigger wins of his career and as big a statement as he could have made here tonight. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called a stop to this contest at three minutes, 44 seconds of round number four. To find the winner by tap out, John So there he is, your winner by way of submission. And how good was that? I mean, you talk about maximizing a UFC showcase, and that's a great example of doing just that. You see him sharing a moment here with his coaches, his training partners, and you can be sure that with the hard work done and the hay in the barn, that these guys are going to be celebrating deep into the night after a submission win like this.